guys, and welcome back to a brand new episode of Expeditions. And we are heading to Sonoran Desert right away. And we're doing heavy load. In one of our last expeditions, the weather conditions changed dramatically. We were forced to return to base. Because of our haste, one of our trucks got stuck somewhere in the quarry, and we didn't have enough time to fix its coordinates. We ask you to find this truck and deliver it to the evacuation point. We can do it. It's quite a lot of traveling. I won't lie. Um, it is hard. And we're going to be using our new truck. This could go horribly, horribly wrong very quickly. <laughs> Might be a little bit rusty. I do apologize about these episodes not coming at the haste they should be. Um, I took a little bit of a break. I've been very, very busy with other games and stuff like that. Uh, I believe we need to get all the way over to here. Oh, boy. It's, there's a lot of traveling. And that's not even the right gateway yet. We're not even there yet. So this could be... Yeah, this could take a while. <laughs> this could take a while indeed. And I'm hoping this truck is good enough. I really, really hope so. Otherwise, that would suck. It's fuel gone down already by 11 litres. What? Don't read that quickly. That can't be right, surely. Ah, uh, this could be tough. <laughs> I've got quite a lot of fuel back there. You can see it. So I guess that's good. Oh, man, this could be... I could regret this very, very quickly. Yeah, apologies about the lack of episodes. Um, let me know if you guys want to see more. Uh, let me know with the like button. Let me know with the comment section below. Um, and we'll definitely keep it going. I do love the game. Um, it's just, it's very time consuming. <laughs> it's very, very time consuming. Ooh, look at that snorkel, by the way. Very nice. I like that. Nice and high. Things we love to see. I'm just hoping this truck's up to it. Fingers crossed. So yeah, I'll meet you at the gateway, and then we head to our, our destination. We've got to try and unstuck the truck. Easy. Easy peasy, he says. Uh. Right, in some ways, I'm quite liking this truck. It's got very good clearance on the front, which is normally quite a big issue um, with this game. Go around this way, actually. But the fuel is going down so quickly. I know it's got a small tank, which it does, it doesn't help uh, the fuel meter gauge. But yeah, it's going down so quick. I'm just worried that it doesn't have a big enough tank to be useful for like long expeditions. But it's it's done really well. I don't think I've taken any damage yet. I wouldn't say I've been particularly like careful as well. It's got a very good clearance. Good grab with those tires. It's obviously got the best tires if you think you can get on, the, on this truck. Probably helps. Um, I don't think it's like a fully upgraded truck by any stretch. Um, yeah, I mean, it's okay. It's just, yeah, I'm really concerned about the fuel already. If we fail this expedition, I'll probably leave it in, honestly. <laughs> a learning experience. Um, I've packed pretty much as much fuel as I can bring, so, yeah. It's, it's a good tester for this truck. I have, to, I have to test it out at some point, and this is the expedition I have chosen. So, yeah, I guess we will go from there. Yeah, I don't know on the sort of longevity of this particular, like, series. Like, I've played SnowRunner, I've played so many episodes, and I feel like it hooked people in a bit more, um, obviously with the cargo and stuff like that. I don't know. I really... I really, I really enjoy making videos on this game. I would love to keep going, but of course, if people don't want to watch it, I don't want to force it down people's throats. Be like, here's part 100, and there's like one person watching. That's it's not a nice feeling. <laughs> um, so yeah, we sort of go episode to episode. Um, maybe try and... Oh, it would be quite cool to maybe unlock some more of the trucks. Maybe do videos on those, maybe. I don't know. I'd be really intrigued to see how this game did in terms of sales compared to SnowRunner. I'm wondering if they, there's a little bit of regret already coming in, in terms of maybe we should have, I don't know, maybe we should have just done like a SnowRunner 2 and spent more time on it. This feels like almost like a bridging gap between SnowRunner, of course, MudRunner, or SnowRunner, and obviously the next SnowRunner game, whatever, whatever that's gonna be. That's what it feels like. This could have been some glorified, a massive DLC for SnowRunner. Potentially. 
potentially. It is, it is, it's, I say that out loud, but there is a lot of content in this game. It look half a tank, and I've only got to the first gateway. Oh boy. Again, I think the truck's great. It's not the fastest, but it's it's just getting... I haven't had any issues as well, though. Like it's just keeps, It keeps trucking. Good clearance as well. It doesn't look like great clearance, but... I don't know. Just, yeah, this works well. But again, the fuel. The fuel's going to be interesting. Yes, it will. I did try and fast travel to here, but it doesn't let me. This <laughs> is like that. <laughs> You're not doing that. Okay, fine. All right, here we go. Let's continue. Well, so obviously we've been here before, but this is how you get to um, the gateway we want to get to, is by going through here. Hopefully that makes sense. So we've got fuel that's already on the truck. You see that little, the little uh, gas containers there. Where are we going? Ah. Does it know where I want to go now? So it's, it's, I have to go to the southeast or something. Is that it? Aha. That's a long way. <laughs> that's a very, very long way. Oh, game, are you kidding me? Is there like a way to like fast travel a bit closer? Uh, please? Yeah, that's that's really far away. There must be a way to fast travel a bit closer. That's That doesn't help. We can go to there. Is that closer? Uh, maybe? A little bit? Uh -uh. Oh, uh, I guess we can fuel up here. That's a plus. Now, this is long. <laughs> this is only us getting to the gateway. We don't even start recovering the truck yet. Madness. Uh, any got, you got spare wheels. No, that's, okay, I think we're good. So, ooh, in terms of the route, because I don't really know. I'm just going to sort of guess here a little bit. Looks pretty capable of doing that, I reckon. That's doable. I'm gonna do skip time as well, so it's nice and nice and bright. There we go. Beautiful. Right, let's get to it. Let's keep trucking. Or maybe I'll just show you guys again the really like cool stuff, like unlocking the new trucks. Um, yeah, that the really cool missions. I don't know. More fuel. <laughs> I just burned three liters doing that. Unbelievable. Alright, let's get to it. A long journey ahead of us. I think I've done a similar route to this before. Pretty doable, it's not too tricky, I think. He says. What's the best way to get down from here? Uh, maybe that over there? Yeah, that works. I was just where the tree's in the way, isn't it? I thought you were going to topple. Might be able to squeeze on the right there, actually. Yeah, that's what that works. If it goes right, that is. That's it. Yes, yeah, so I've got fuel in the rear, fuel uh, behind the, uh, the cabin. I mean, I brought as much as I could. Um, do I want to go? I think that's the best route. Going down. I should probably know this by now. I have been here a couple of times. I think the game the game looks absolutely cracking. I do again. I wonder how it's done in terms of sales. I feel like I haven't seen a whole lot of hype for the game since the launch. Maybe I'm wrong. See, some other trucks would have taken a hit there. This just... just rolls. Just is happy. Very good clearance. I wonder if it can pull, though. Seems like we have to do a recovery on a truck. Oh, we're going into water. Okay. Does look pretty tight around here. Scott, are you sure this is the best route? <laughs> I'm now having doubts. I'm now having doubts. And that's fine. Yeah, um, why have you just attached yourself to that rock? So, right then up here. Yep. 
it is a formidable truck so far. Okay, just a little bit thirsty. It's a guzzler. It's a big old guzzler. This will be a test on the old clearance. This is a big old drop. I'm expecting damage here. No? Look at that. The way it just cushions its fall. Very nicely done. Don't have to put the diff on either. Lower the tire pressures. Just keep, just keeps going. As long as you get it in the right position. Not a bad truck. I haven't heard again much hype about this truck. I was expecting too much. Um, yeah, it's, again, it's been pretty good. Maybe people just don't like the fuel tank, which I guess is fat. <laughs> I get it. completely understand. I don't believe this is the gate we've been into yet. So we're good if we can get a new uh, new outpost up and running as well. One million percent. Uh, so there's a bridge down on the left. I think we can get through here. I think I've done it before. I do have some spare parts on me. Um, I don't know if I want to use them right now, though. Unless I have to. Clearance! Ooh. <laughs> it was fine there. Yeah, another truck sort of definitely like the step would be like. <laughs> Engine damaged. It was a little bit deeper than I imagined. It's all good. Don't worry. Don't get stuck. Don't get stuck. I want to get out here, actually. I remember doing this before. I think I went all the way to the end and I couldn't work out how to get out. I think I want to get out here on the left. Turn. Go. off again. Leave that topple over. Do have jack screws, but I don't really want to use them at the moment. Uh, how do I want to operate this? I want to try and get up here. That's the engine one gonna do actually is quickly check the handbrake on. Yeah, all 100 percent so far, and I've been driving for quite a while now. Again, not particularly like overly careful either. Uh go around here and then take a right. Hope I can get up here. Ooh, this might be tricky. Smart but tricky. Wow. Holy moly. Seriously? Wow. <laughs> I was getting ready there. I was like, okay, sure. But we must be getting fairly close. Okay, we're not. Wow. Wowzers. I thought we were getting close. We are nowhere near yet. <laughs> oh, boy. Oh. You can see why... I Videos on this game do take a long time to make as well. <laughs> they, 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 they just do. Which again, I don't mind. It's just there's a limited amount of time in the day. So if this video takes a couple of hours and then probably people don't like watching it and there's no views, then it's hard to then go, I can warrant the time to then come back and do more. Um, it's just like the realistic, yeah, I don't know. And then if things go wrong as well, this one could go very, very wrong. This could go very, very wrong. Like, I might not even finish the expedition. Like, the fuel's down to half again. 
I'm sure there'll be some comments like, oh, you could do a bit better with, like, fuel management, and you're probably right. But I'm trying to get from point A to B here. I'm trying to, I'm trying to get it done. In a, in a decent enough fashion. A decent speed as well, ideally. As he rocks into high gear. Come on! That's surprisingly heavy, actually. Now we're motoring. Now we're motoring. Let's go! Why did he pop it down into first turn? No idea. I remember this being a little bit of a tricky bit. Can I... Get across there? Hopefully. Come on. Wow. Wow. Ah, this is sometimes where the truck feels like it's going to roll. This bit is, um, is fun. Uh, very, very fun. Right, let's lock the diff. Um, can I put an anchor up ahead? I'm not, not close enough yet. Can I put an anchor in yet? Please. We really don't want to fool. But I'm attached. Oh, I don't like doing that bit. I do not like doing that bit. I swear I put the um What was it? I thought it was pilled now. Like a, is it a testing kit or mining for something? Why am I actually? Why am I taking this route, by the way? Doesn't make any sense why I'm taking this route. I am an idiot. Right now we're gonna take some full damage. There's no avoiding this. Uh, what? What? Are you actually kidding me? That's actually unbelievable this truck is I don't know if it's got like a very rigid like frame or something it just how how man if you weren't so thirsty I'd be using you a lot like a lot a lot it's so annoying like we've got a really good truck here but we may not actually make it Oh, God. I think that sums this game up perfectly. Oh, we're very close, actually. Okay, so we're getting to the gateway. I'm hoping we can find... I don't think there's any... I might do. Is there any airdrops around here that I can go and grab some fuel? I don't think there is. At least we've been in the vicinity of, like, being able to get them. Nice. No, there's the gateway. I guess I can see that. All right, let's go. Yeah, we need an airdrop fairly quickly. Again, we do have fuel on us, so it's not an instant panic. Like, we're not going to run out straight away. But eventually we might. Damn. What in Again, we're not taking any damage yet. No damage. Just damage to the fuel tank. In terms of we have no fuel. Extremely, extremely impressive. Considering... Again, I haven't been driving that carefully. If I've been driving carefully, then, then fair enough. Right. This is the first time we're entering this gateway. I like I've driven past this so many times, but I've never actually gone into it. Yay! Success! Oh, yeah. Woo! A dry, hot area. Once divided by a full-flowing river. Wow. Of which now little is left. In some places, timid what's that? Timid attempts to industrialize the region are visible. <laughs> Weird way of saying it. Uh, which clearly did not succeed. So there might be like essences of I don't know, like buildings that have been tried to be been set up and failed. I can see why probably they probably can't reach here in one piece. It's such an insane area. Right, I'm hoping the game lets me know exactly where I need to go. 
That looks pretty far away. Oh boy. So there's the truck. I'm hoping I've got to take it just to there. Which isn't too bad. Alright, let's go and explore the unknown. So what I will do is set like a general waypoint to here. So I know roughly where I'm going. I would love um, some fuel. You got any fuel? <laughs> <laughs> I'm pretty sure there's some um, interesting trucks here as well, which I definitely want to try and get at some point. Why should I go left here or right? Let's go left. Let's go for the slightly more tricky terrain. Airdrops. Keeping an eye out. Not seen any yet. I mean, ideally, I'd like to explore here a bit more, but once the expedition's done as well, I don't necessarily want to extract straight away. Let's see, maybe a bridge location, but that's pretty much it so far. This is a pretty cool area, though. I, again, they've done an incredible job with the with the map design in this game. I think they've done. I think they'd, if they were in SnowRunner, they'd be up there with the best maps in the game, easily. That cannot be um, understated. This looks a little bit dodgy. Oh, that's the first time we've had some clearance issues, and it still didn't really care. <laughs> Maybe it did it a little bit now. It's the first time it's got stuck. It's pretty, um, pretty crazy. Crazily high. There we go. Ugh. Don't damage the tires. Did I see a bridge? Maybe it didn't actually. I'll take it back. Right, yeah, the fuel is starting to look critical. I think this, this may be the um, the biggest part of this video. It's just me running out of fuel, honestly. Uh, right, what I'm going to do quickly, just have a little scout around. Uh, turn the engine off. Just make sure there's nothing around that I can, I can grab. Anything up here? So it feels like the sort of location where a drop might be. But nope. I see naps. Annoying. Absolutely annoying. What is going on here? It's a big area and there's no drops. I can't see anything. So now I don't have my glasses on. So I'm hoping that's maybe the issue. Time for D-Dallion. We must keep trucking. I'm going to just keep going until it runs out. Just drain every last little drip from this, uh, this tank. And then put some more in. Ooh. Is that down there? Sure. This is going to take some damage. Or not again. What, the? what a truck. Ow. I don't believe that's... Is that my first bit of damage? I think it is. Again, that's probably... That's definitely on me. <laughs> I mean, it's normally always on me, but... Let me out. Yeah, that's our first bit of damage. When you see the amount of smoke coming out of the back of this vehicle, you, see, you do wonder why. Okay, maybe that's where the fuel's going. Um, let's try and get down from here. Could use a winch, maybe. How do I actually get across here? Put 
put it down there. Ah, do a drop here. One sec. Then how do I get up this bit? It's like quarry. Not really a quarry, is it? Like a stream. How do I get up here? That's a very, very good question. Uh, right, park it up here. Turn the engine off. Anything that looks like it might work. I reckon we go left. That's what I'm thinking. We've tried up there, actually. That could work. Okay. The, literally the slope right in front of us. It's one of those situations where obviously having the map fully scouted out would be very useful. Okay, we're going to fuel up the engine. We've got a fair amount. 255. Five, so obviously you can fill it up completely again. So it's now full. Okay, good. I'm trying to go that slope. Wish me luck. It does look pretty tired. And pretty steep. Can we got that? Okay, I don't want to like, waste time on stuff that I, I can't do it. That looks very steep. That looks incredibly steep. I mean, anchor might help us, but... There's no way, surely. I'll put my handbrake on. And attach it to... Oh. Why can't I get to the green bit? It sort of stops there for some reason. Don't know why. Put it there. Oh, there. No, I don't want to waste my time doing this if it's not going to work. Okay. The closer I got to it, the more ambitious it looked. <laughs> I do not want to like waste my time using a winch, going up and down, up and down. Ain't gonna work. Just no point. I'm gonna try and loop around this way and pray there's like a way to get up. This is one of the exciting parts about playing this game though: exploring the unknown, working a route, navigating through. Doing the impossible. That's that's the that's the, the bits I like in SnowRunner as well. And there's a lot of this in this game. I mean, hence the school expedition. There's like a little airdrop. Oh, beautiful. And that sort of sight to behold. Objective is still there. We're not really getting much closer, are we? Still haven't found a way to get up, really. Uh, great. I do get a little bit panicky when I'm like, I honestly can't find a way up. What, what am I supposed to do? That went the wrong way. No! And go that way. But again, I'm not really getting closer to the objective. I'm sort of looping around. I go just go left. Go left now. Will Scott ever find this truck? 
Unless we find like a little upgrade or something right now. To make it at least worthwhile. Where does this go? Uh -huh. I don't know. Not really looking at where I'm going. It's probably a bad idea. I'll look for a way up. See some dotted lines, which I'm guessing is probably a bridge or a task or a contract. It's definitely a bridge. Do I want to get across there? I believe I do, yes. Damn it. Okay. Please tell me we have enough. Please. I have a few. Oh, no. Do I have enough? Oh, I do have enough. I, read that. I always read those wrong, the numbers. Every time. Every time. We started when it was light. It's now getting dark again. <laughs> Am I the only person that wants these bridges to be a little bit wider? Okay, I guess I'm trying to make it... Yes, you've fixed an issue. But you haven't solved all of the issues. Still got to try and get across the bridge, which is quite a small bridge. Right, the numbers are going down. Whee! We're actually heading to the destination. I push a little bit. It's quite rocky around here. This would be a nice little helping hand. Oh, what's this? Oh, climb. Nice. Well, at least we got a hundred dollars. Is it dollars? I don't know what you think it is. Where's this truck? Come on. What's this? Might as well grab it while I'm here. Let's see if it's like a potentially like a truck one. Oh. A new crew member potentially. Alright. I think I'm not gonna follow it now, but I think I have it unlocked at least. A lot of die lines back here. This one. Um, I don't want it. Is this where maybe I had to drop something off? Right, so we are. We're here. Is that the, the start of the actual quest? Or maybe where it ends? Looks like we've still got. A little way to go, and I don't quite know how we're going to get to it yet. And we've got to return it as well. So, yeah. <laughs> There's a way to get up. I've got I've got the handbrake on there. No, I don't. Okay. Does the handbrake go on when I'm changing the tire pressures? I don't just realise that. Okay, not that. Oh, poo. Where do I go? Uh, okay, sort of in the middle, so it's not actually like high up. I thought it was high up for some reason. Um, I'm really... Why has it not been like just a little airdrop just sitting there for me? 
very rude of the game not to do that for me. Why not? This is pretty steep. I don't really have much of a choice. This is where I'm going. <laughs> Keep going! Right, quick turn the engines off. Um, definitely off, yep. Send the drone out. I'm starting to get a little bit concerned about fuel. Don't, I don't see any airdrops. Maybe this is a place where they don't do airdrops. I'm also trying to work out where we're going to go as well. It's like we're close, but we're not. I don't know if that makes sense. I think we loop round, but that's all I've got. That's all I've got. I just have a weird feeling. I'm just going to upload the video anyway, even if we fail. <laughs> I don't care. <laughs> I do not care. I'm not doing all of this. And I run out of fuel. And I'm not going to upload it. No way. I will pretend the task is done, even though it's not. I knew the risks when I started it. I'm, I was fully aware of the risks. And I will just have to um, stomach it if I screw up. I will have to suffer the consequences. Where are you, beloved vehicle? It's stuck. Also, dragging a vehicle isn't exactly um, economical as well. Yeah. So that's where it is. Oh, yeah, I see it. Okay. I'm not sure I'm going to have to get down. Uh... Try this, I guess. Oh boy. Sorry about the damage. It's fine. It's all good. It's all good. It's all good. It's all good. Oh, let's go with the climb. Well, I'm going down the climb. Can I go back out that way, do you think? Really? I don't, don't, don't think so. I sort of went off a cliff there, didn't I, basically? Maybe? Maybe? Might be possible. I could give it a go. I could give it a go. Definitely nothing wrong with giving it a go. Well, at least we reached the truck. I guess that's a positive. What truck is it? Let's begin the winching. Are you awake? Let's go! That's not a good start. <laughs> Is this going to work? Oh. It's all works. At least we're moving, I guess. This is my fuel man! Are you going to start moving, or are you just going to... Why has it gone, as soon as we've met up with the truck, it's gone horrifically wrong. Like, the actual objective that we want to do. I haven't got much fuel left. Yeah, this is going to be failing, isn't it? 100%. As soon as I got here, it's gone horribly, 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 horribly wrong since I got here. Horribly wrong. Completely fine the whole way here. 
the truck now doesn't seem to work. It's just lost. Apparently, it's all of its. I don't know what's going on here. Like, you're gonna, you're gonna move, or you're just gonna. What is? What are you even stuck on? You're stuck on nothing. What are you doing? Unbelievable. Like, there's no way in hell we're doing this now. Why did I have to try a different truck for? Again, this is another reason the video. I'm like, oh, let's do it. Let's use the other truck. Let's do it. I probably wouldn't have done. I probably wouldn't have used this truck if I was playing it by myself. Like, I, I know it's got a small truck, a small tank. I know it's got a small tank. Like, why would I possibly do this? Oh, oh my god. Yeah, literally, as soon as we've arrived, everything has gone possible. Anything that could have gone wrong has gone wrong basically is what I'm trying to say. It has gone horrendously wrong. I've got nothing left to do here. Like, I don't know. I don't know what more you want from me. I, I, um, freaking real. You stupid, stupid truck. Let's look at both of them now as well, to be honest. And where is a freaking airdrop as well? I haven't seen an airdrop in like 10 years. I've been looking everywhere. Like, just put an airdrop here. But what does that truck even do? What's the what's happening to the wheels? Are they broken? Like, what are you doing? This truck has no pulling capacity at all, as well. That's, what has happened to that truck? It is damaged. That was like bugged out on me or something. Doesn't seem to look at it. I think we're moving apparently, but again, unless we find an airdrop or something very, very quickly, this ain't happening. It's not happening at all. Is the engine off? Good. Jesus. Why did I? Why can't I just use the step again? Just use that truck. Just use the same one. So I know I got a route. Again, we need an airdrop. Where is a freaking airdrop? Right, there's a slight chance, maybe, maybe, if we don't hit any obstacles on this route, maybe, maybe, we have to be absolutely spot on here. Right, come on. Hey, that's not spot on, is it? That's that's getting stuck already. I'll turn the engine off again straight away because you're just being stupid. <sighs> Let me touch to the right point now. Come on, go. This is, this is literally what I was asking you not to do. Come on, it's stuck. If it actually started moving when I said, I think there was a slight chance we could have made it as well. But it was like, nah. There's one wheel. Come on, I swear to God, if you make it now. What? Why? Why do you now make it? Why? Are you taking... Are you actually taking the mickey out of me? Are they actually taking the mickey out of me? Like, why would it make it now? Um, for, um, unbelievable. Absolutely unbelievable. Why didn't it make it earlier? I'm going to run out in seconds here. Un freaking believable. Might be turning the engine on. Does it even work? I need some fuel from you. Makes sense, wouldn't it? No, you can't do that. That might even help me earlier. Turning the engine on. Look at that. Okay, we're gonna get we're gonna run out of fuel here, I reckon. Just going for it. Come on. Why is that no freaking airdrop? One airdrop. One airdrop since arriving. And we're out of fuel. Out of fuel. Cheers, game. 
fantastic. I don't know when this, this series is coming back. That's done me in. That's absolutely done me in. Unbelievable. Unbelievable. Unfreaking believable. The way it just randomly decided it wouldn't start moving. I was there. I don't know if I, how much of that footage I'm going to include. I was there for a while trying to get that truck out. At the last split second, it then decides it wants to move after trying for so long. It didn't do anything different. Nothing different at all. It then decides it wants to. Oh, I'm speechless. Absolutely speechless. Absolutely speechless. So if I want to do this again, that's the distance, by the way. It didn't even mention remotely that was the distance. 6,000 meters. It said 4,000. The numbers are completely off. The numbers are completely off. So if I want to do it again, because apparently I've got no life, I can just keep doing this over and over again. I, I'm, it's, it's all good. It's all good fantastic absolutely smashing i can definitely do it again um deploy i can put me anywhere closer nope great an hour of footage is in the bin basically unbelievable the way the vehicle just gave up there's no airdrops anywhere in the vicinity of that mission absolute joke mm -hmm.